Hello everyone, this is Satvik and this video I am going to showcase my POC video where I was able to bypass OTP and which lead to account takeover of any user on the particular website. So before getting started, so if you are new to my channel, so view other videos as well. So watch other videos as well. And if you really find them interesting and useful, just subscribe because it will be a bit motivation for me. And also, if you want to connect with me, you can check out my Twitter. The link in the description below. And if you want to be part of the channel's community, you can check out my Discord server. So what happened is like, uh, so you can see the screenshots I took are from today itself. So fairly new and I redacted few information. But before that, let me give you a brief information of what this target is and what this domain is all about. So there is a new, a fairly new VPN company. Okay. And there is a subdomain in which you can see what are all the devices that are connected or what are all the devices that are using that particular VPN. Okay. So the authentication is pretty straightforward. Like uh, this is, uh, for example, this is the first request here. So you can see it's an author post request and there is a location authenticate the host and sort of stuff. So I redacted them uh, because it is still under processing. So I don't want to break the uh, like policy of that company. Then you can see I provided an email and there is an option called as like send OTP. So I clicked on that and I this is the proper OTP guys. OK, so this is the right OTP and you can see the OTP is of six digits. So what I've done right now is like I just uh, uh, what you say, like I just intercepted the response for this request. So the next screenshot is the response. OK, you can see that uh, it gave me a proper response because it is a valid code. And you can see it gave me a token and this token is of JWT token. So JWT token are used for session handling. So you can go to this JWT.io website and uh, you can paste the uh, code over here that uh, uh, that code like for example uh, this is an example code you can see it consists of some sort of decoded information like what is the algorithm that is being used a type name iat and some sort of stuff here so you can edit them and even the code gets changed over here so you can make use of this website so you can see there is a token and you can see the expiry is on like uh, you can see it's of 13 March. Like I took the screenshot on 6th March and it has like 7 days. Like I can use the same response for like 7 days like even without having an OTP. So that's a uh, thing like you shouldn't have a token expiry of that many days. Okay it should be like uh, pretty straightforward like uh, it depends how, on how well like mo it should be mostly of like 24 hours after 24 hours the token should get expired so that is what i believe so i captured this response and i just copied it and i just put uh, kept that somewhere in my notes and then i have one more account in this website itself so the account is also mine only so i didn't uh, compromise others you can see there is one i sent one more request with an otp of like four zeros like some invalid otp like you can give six zeros or four zeros like anything it should be invalid and i intercepted the response for this request as well okay and what happened is like like uh, i changed the particular response that i got with the one that i copied like uh, i'll show you once so there is this particular request right uh, this response that right? i just copied the response for this and I just pasted the response for this uh, request. And then what happened is like it successfully bypassed. Like even though there is some sort of token like session management, but it is not being validated properly. So like if there is no proper validation, then there is no use of this particular token. And also the expiry date is on like 13 March. <laughs> so after seven days, this is going to be uh, expired. So like you can use this response for seven days. Okay, and you can pretty much take over any account. Okay, any account uh, like it can be from admin account to if you know the emails or sort of stuff like you can simply do that. It is pretty simple. And once you log in, right? So this is my account. So you can see uh, there are a few devices over here. So this is my account. But if I log in, uh, like uh, I even got a response like I bypassed the restriction, right? So this is the uh, detailed information about that user. So you can see that uh, my device is OnePlus 60, which I installed that VPN on. And uh, you can see this is another users. Uh, you can see the user IDs are different. You can see that. So 168638. And here the user ID is like 168639. Uh, so that being said guys so like uh, this is pro uh, this is an authentication bypass so i produce this uh, poc video and they sent to their relevant authorities and they replied me quickly 
and they told that they are working on it so the su the suggestion that i given is like to implement a proper session management and also the expiry date should be like bit less like uh, that is what i feel but i'm not sure whether they will take that or not but uh, there is no proper authentication or this authorization so that should be implemented so like this is one type of a bypass guys like you cannot see this sort of bypass bypass on every websites like some websites due to some misconfigurations uh, you, you can exploit this sort of stuff but uh, end of the day it's all about testing so uh, it may work or it may not work so that's it and that being said this is the end of this video guys this is a short video so regarding a poc and i redacted a lot of information over here uh, because the co you know the company has like policy like non disclosure program so until or unless they told you uh, they tell you to do that you cannot do that you cannot disclose the information or like you cannot write the reports or sort of stuff but you can write reports if you are not mentioning their company name like if exam uh, like i'm not i haven't mentioned anything i just gave a glimpse about it's a vpn company uh, but there are thousands of i think lakhs of vpn companies out there you cannot find this sort of bug okay so and also guys like that's it for this video so if you do end up liking this video make sure you like it and do share with your friends who are really interested in this sort of stuff uh, this is satvik signing off i'll meet you in the next video thank you